Welcome back to News 5 at 10 o'clock. Mobile police are collecting more money than ever from home and business owners for security alarm registration. Police only began enforcing it last year. As News 5's Chad Petrie reports, police believe there's almost a million dollars in uncollected fees out there. Mark Moore is the president of TSI Alarms and Audio in Mobile. And he, like a lot of people, says he was caught off guard when Mobile Police said they were bringing back an annual fee for registering your alarm with the city. Well, it's funny that they're putting it back because I never knew when it was here. So uh, I have been doing this a long time. The law hadn't been enforced in roughly two decades. Last year, MPD began sending courtesy letters to homeowners and every business owner in Mobile reminding them to pay that registration fee. More than 8,000 letters have been sent. You know, I think a disconnect or lack of communication between what city council was doing and uh, the, I guess, the administration at the time, plus the police department, on, on who exactly was responsible for enforcing the ordinance. Between fiscal year 2016 and the start of fiscal year 2017, Mobile Police collected more than $138,000 in fees, but they budgeted for half a million in 2017. We chose a half a million dollars, which is what we think would be a half compliance with the public. Starting sometime this year, Barber says the courtesy notices will end and they'll enforce it with fines. Some homeowners may resent the resurrection of the fee, but Barber says annual calls for false alarms cost them a lot more. Collections in this fiscal year slowed because the department said they almost ran out of letters to send. In Mobile, Chad Petrie, News 5. Mobile's